It's been more than a year since a man shot and killed a beloved store owner inside his shop. The store has been closed ever since, but next month a new business will go in its place. News Channel 15's Fina Gleros joins us live from our newsroom with that story. Some close to Antonio Nino, the owner of Smokehouse Tobacco Outlet, have mixed feelings about that building being open again, saying it will bring back painful reminders shopping there. But the owners hope this will help the community move forward. The doors have been closed here at the Smokehouse Tobacco Outlet off of Lafayette Street since last year. On an April morning, Jamel Coleman robbed owner Antonio Nino inside his store, shooting and killing him in the process. He was a good guy. A lot of people loved him in the community. It's very sad it happened to him, you know, and it was just a question of chance that it was him at the spot, you know, at that time. Now, nearly a year and a half later, these doors are unlocked with Nino's brother's support. The new owners say several of Nino's customers have asked when it'll open. The new store, now named Get and Go, is getting fresh paint and new merchandise. Chips, pop, uh, coffee, uh, cappuccino, uh, cigarettes, tobacco, and uh, bill pay, facts, everything that uh, a community would feel free to come and do over here and feel comfortable and be easy for them to just walk in and get their stuff done. The owners will add lights outside, keep these surveillance cameras and add more. We not forgetting it, we need to move forward and reopen this location because it's a, it's, it's a really good location where people do need a grocery store like this. The store is set to open September 10th. Reporting in Fort Wayne, Gina Galeros, News Channel 15.